sa mga wala pa pong asawa dyan. Go! Go! So, uh, today, kasama po natin si Clarice. Isa po siyang nurse sa, uh, sa Central London. Uh, she works sa isang uh, intensive uh, care unit uh, na neonatal. So, uh, isa pa pong fun fact about her, uh, siya na lang po magsasabi. <laughs> Baka po tayo mawala ng guests. <laughs> so, yes. Uh, yeah, si Clarice po, kasabay po natin dum- uh, dumating dito sa UK. Uh, she's also a nurse here for 10 years. And like her, very diverse ang kanyang experience. She worked outside uh, outside London and then now, she works literally in, in, in the central d- district area of London. So, it would be nice to understand anong meron uh, experience sa kanya. Ah, ma, anong experience na? Sorry. Right. So, isa sa mga magandang tanong natin dyan about yung uh, difference in pay. So, sy- syempre, sabi ko nga kanina sa introduction ko sa iyo, Clarice, uh, galing ka sa labas ng London. Ngayon, nandito ka na sa London. So, Ano ba ang main difference? Meron ba malaking difference pay? Tell us all about your experience and also your transition from outside to inside London. So, ang basic difference is yung high cost allowance which is around 5 grand depending on 5 grand a year, 5,000 pounds a year depending on which part of London, London you are. Sa, uh, Kasi meron yung central London which is, I don't know how many percent. 20%. 20%. Ha! And then, meron pa yung outside London and then yung fringes of London. Uh-huh. Mga banks. Ha-ha. Uh-huh. Banks London. So, yun yung main difference. Meron kang additional um, 4 to 5 grand a year. And then, the other difference is kapag nag-extra shift ka, mas mataas yung bayad nila. Ah, yung rate? Yung, yung rate ba- parang bank yung, rate? Ah, parang okay. bank or agency rate. So, nice. you get more from extra time from, uh, I mean, overtime. Pero need just to say, uh, we should expect then sa, sa London area, mas mataas pa rin ng costs of living, particularly transport siguro. Yeah, transport. So, bigyan mo nga kami ng idea magkano yung transport. So, for example, to a two-bedroom flat from where, sa kung saan mm. kami nakatira is 1,200 per month. Okay. And then, council tax works around 166 because dun sa area namin, mahal talaga Mahal talaga yun. Depending sa kung gano yung kaposh yung sa uh, na area. Posh. And then, yung commute, hmm, probably, I would say 150 per month. 130, 150. 150. Depending sa shifts mo kasi kung madalas kang nights or kung madalas kang weekends, mas mura kasi mura. off-peak na yun. So, uh, next question naman natin, please, is uh, ano ba ang advantages of working uh, inside London? Uh, I mean, yung nagtatrabaho sa, sa isang London hospital, meron bang distinct advantages from before? So, apart from better pay, mas malaming guwapong staff, malaming guwapong staff, malaming guwapong staff, <laughs> mas diverse, uh-huh ang um, population like uh-huh. your colleagues they come from all over the, the world uh, so, parang, for example where i work uh, we have australians kiwis americans canadians uh, um, Vietnam, east then <laughs> japanese chinese yes uh, cambodians uh, name it uh, so maganda yung exposure mo around the world tapos but kidding aside um, apart from better pay, mas marami kang, mas marami silang um, budget for study days or for development, for professional development. So, they send you um, multiple study days a year. Ikaw ang susuko sa dami ng study days. So, para lang sa mga viewers natin dyan, no? ang, ang study days is like seminars sa atin yes. sa Pilipinas. Kasi, uh, ang study days natin means ang pwedeng in-house sa hospital, pero meron pa rin study days na ang nag, nag like, uh, ano is mas malalaking let's say uh, yung companies di ba kasi sa yeah. intensive care so mas maraming uh, product na yun lang dun lang sa mm-hmm. nagiragamit so I guess that's or organizations or special specialties if you want to further your career na mag specialize ka sa, sa, sa area na to pwede ka nilang supportahan so much more support in terms of 
yung professional growth uh-huh. mo. And then, yung sinabi mo about, interested din ako yung sinabi mo about uh, development with regards sa ranking. Mabilis yes, din ba yung yes, ranking yes. Uh, pag-accept mo sa'yo? Kasi ba? if for for your yearly appraisal, talagang nakita nila na you want to gain yung more experience on management. Or so, so, supportahan ka nila talaga para ah. maka, makamit <laughs> to, to gain your, yeah, <laughs> to gain the, the your dream, ah, ah. dream level. Ah, yeah. so that's yeah. good. So, isa, isa yun sa mga advantages. Ah, okay, that's very good. Yeah. Alright, so, ang next question natin, um, uh, ito maraming may gusto malaman, is, ano naman ang advantages of living the London uh, lifestyle? Kasi, Diba sabi mo nga, galing ka sa labas, uh, kanina na sa labas ng London, tapos tumira ka na ngayon in, into London, ano ba yung distinct advantages? At meron ba talaga? There's more to see, more to eat, more to meet. Wow! wow. wow. <laughs> De, um, more social in general. <laughs> okay, sige, social. <laughs> social, okay. as in, because, kunwari sa, sa work, if you if they will plan something to go, to do outside of work, mas maraming choices. Mm. May mga, not just dining out, may mga ibang activities, color runs, paddle boarding somewhere, rock climbing, mga gadon. Mas maraming choices to be social in and out of work, nice. per se. Okay. And then, maraming kakainan, maraming restaurants to choose from. And I see na sa yung sa, sa, sa yung uh, Instagram account very well documented to mga labas labas mo, no? And yes. also, uh, <laughs> well traveled ka rin, di ba? So, siguro, maglalagay natin din yung Instagram account ng ating good friend here in um, Clarice, and you can follow her, no? Mm-hmm. So, <laughs> para diba ng aming followers? <laughs> For their benefit, too. <laughs> yes. Para sa beneficyo ng kam- sa kalahatan. Okay? Alright. So, yeah. So, meron ko pa bang masasabi about London? And do you really love living in London, working in London? Yung ba masasabi mo? Yes. Yes. Definitely. Mm. So, again, thank you for watching another episode of us here in Manong George. We'd like to thank all our subscribers, our followers uh, sa Facebook. Thank you very much sa ating uh, subscribers dito sa YouTube channel natin. Thank you again. Big thanks. And also, I'd just like to say again, uh, big thanks to our good friend here, Clarice, for joining us and sharing us uh, sharing with us her experience. Basta tandaan niyo po kung may kailangan po kayo malaman about nursing here in the UK, whether it's inside London or outside London. Be sure to remember that... One knows best.